Hey everybody, Daryl and Holly with Exquisite Exotics here. Welcome to today's video. I, I'm gonna get Holly to laugh. I'm trying to get her to laugh every single one at the beginning. So well, far, so good. Y'all know what he does. It works sometimes. Um, anyway, uh, today's video is I know we've been talking about kind of like announcements and changes, kind of like throwing in little hints here and there. Um, but today we're gonna make an announcement. So uh, <clears throat> this really is an announcement that's important for those of uh, you who are local to us. So I know a lot of people on our YouTube channel aren't local to us. Still feel free to watch. You don't need to click off now. I know you are already. You're like, no, this isn't me. Click. I'm gone. Um, so you're gonna I miss. Would. You're gonna <laughs> miss this anyway. Um, but for those of you local to us. You know, something we've noticed over the years of doing this, uh, especially having this ourselves um, and having exotic pets and uh, saltwater aquariums that I had for almost a decade. Um, one of the things that is really hard to do, <clears throat> excuse me, if you have exotic animals is to find somebody to watch those exotic animals when you go away. Vacation, visiting friends, a weekend away, doesn't matter what it is, it's just kind of hard to find somebody. Tons of people to watch cats and dogs, but exotic pets, not so much. So we're adjust my hat. Um, we're expanding the business to include exotic pet sitting. So that would be reptiles, amphibians, small animals like hedgehogs, ferrets, bunny rabbits, um, aquariums, both freshwater, which I do have experience from my childhood. <clears throat> Excuse me again. Uh, and saltwater aquariums, which I have like a decade of experience in almost. Um, plus, I've kept up with the industry even though I don't have a saltwater aquarium right now. I watch almost all the videos from BRS yeah. still. Um, so saltwater aquarium stuff. Um, so that's your big constrictors as well. The only thing we're not going to be doing is no venomous. Uh, and unfortunately, I know some of you are going to be surprised by this, but I'm actually quite arachnophobic, so uh, no arachnids either. Um, so other than that, though, pretty much watch anything. Uh, if you have a cat and dog as well, because we're watching the exotic pets, I will watch them or we will watch them as well. Um, but not specifically just cats and dogs. So uh, if you're only looking for a cat or a dog or a cat dog sitter, that's not us. Uh, if you're looking for exotic pets plus a cat or dog, we can do that. Um, and that's the big announcement. So uh, we will be adding that to our website in the next you know, couple months here. Um, starting putting out uh, information on you know the, the pet setting sites, all that stuff, um, and expanding out to doing that. So if you're local and you have an interest, feel free to reach out to us for that. Um, and I think that's it. That's the big announcement. That's it's cool. kind of what we've been working towards now for a while. Yep. So, huh? I, you know, just Daryl has experience with everything that he actually said. So, you know, I met you and all the animals you listed you had growing up and I think I said hedgehogs. I don't think I had a hedgehog. I, never had I thought you said, oh, okay. I, Small you know mammals. What? I was I had thinking a lot. hamster because you had a ton of I hamsters. I did have hamsters and guinea pigs and ferrets. Mm -hmm. I've had a lot of oh, and bunny rabbits and yeah. So, um, yeah. But Stuff that you're experienced with and yeah. you know some people might think like well you just grab somebody in your family to do it and that's great. We've done that in the past. You know it's yeah. you know willing family member to you know handle an animal that they don't normally like handling but um this kind of takes it to a different level because you're getting that professional care and know exactly what your animal needs. Yeah, and especially those of you who have saltwater aquariums, you know how much you have invested, not only money-wise, because they can be quite pricey, but also time. You know, you can put years into an aquarium and it's great that you have, you know, that family member who comes over and checks the aquarium for you, but do they know what to do in case of emergency? Do they know how to do a, a test for I don't know, um, calc, calc, mag, nitrate, uh, pH, ammonia, whatever test, you know. Do they know how to do that stuff? Have they ever done it before? Like, um, What if your feeder breaks and just dumps food oh, into yeah. your entire Your, your auto feeder. Or what if you run on an apex and your apex goes wacky? Or your apex gives you an alarm and you're, you're, you know, your house sitter is like, I don't know what to do for this. Um, you your skimmer's overflowing. You know, like, anyway. Uh, those are specifically, if you have one of those, you know that it can be hard to find somebody reliable that knows enough about them to watch them for you. So that's definitely going to be a focus of the um, pet sitting stuff as well. And this isn't the only thing that we probably will be expanding into. Maybe. Down the line. <laughs> Maybe. I love how you shake your head like, right. mm, but Daryl's got lots of ideas. Whether yeah. you put them into play or not. Yes. This doesn't mean this is probably this isn't probably the only announcement ever. So no, but I don't have this will be the only announcement for a while. <laughs> okay, put it that way. Sure. It's gonna be a little while until anything else gets announced. Um, but this is a big one, so mm, it's huge. Yeah, uh, especially for us, it's you know a big next step. Mm -hmm. So anyway, what? 
I'm proud of you. Oh my gosh. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> I thought, that might be like the first time I've heard that in like... Really? A decade. Really? Oh god. I want to get emotional. <laughs> I'm welling up over here. I've got the vapors. What? That's an old saying from the south. Got the vapors, it's like you're starting to cry. No. They say it in Futurama. We watch Futurama all the time. Fry says it when he's underwater with the mermaids. You guys watch Futurama? Who watches Futurama? Put that in the comments. Who watches that show? That show's amazing. You watch Futurama. I do you love, love Futurama. I don't remember that. <clears throat> yeah, it's in the, when, when they go to the lost city of At Atlanta and there's yes. the mermaids and he <laughs> Fry gets all southern after. all of a sudden. Yeah. yeah. He's like, oh, I got the vapors. No? Yeah, I've never heard that before. Yeah, okay. Anyway, this is why you guys really watch these videos for this kind of banter at the end of the video, right? Like, you don't actually watch it for the other stuff. It's all for this. We're both wearing Harley shirts today. Neither of us are in Harley Davidson's. We're posers. <laughs> this is poser day. Okay. Anything else, Holly, no, related we, to the announcement? No, Jeez, we, why did you get a soft topic? We've wasted these people's time. Probably. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You good? I'm, I'm something. <laughs> Okay. Anything else to add? No. All right. Uh, so that's the announcement, guys. If you're local, feel free to reach out if it's something you're interested in. Um, I know that could be hard sometimes to find people. What is local, stuff. by the way? How far away <clears throat> is too far away? Uh, there is no too far away necessarily, but would there be discussions of pricing? Oh, okay. If everybody's interested. Okay. Uh, and Good for job. those who are asked, kind of like, you know, what's local? Where are you? Uh, we're located in between Frederick and Westminster in Maryland. Mar in Maryland. Um, so we're in like almost dead in between those two. Um, so, but you know, listen, Baltimore, DC, those aren't too far away. If you are interested, you know, reach out to me and we can, we can talk pricing and that kind of stuff. Go down to Shoreline? If I need to. Okay. Time's not free though. So, you know, okay. keep that in mind. If you want me to make a three hour drive to your house every day, I don't work. I don't drive for three hours for free. Nobody expects that. Yeah, I would hope not. We're, we're done here. We Are we good? Just, we should just cut it right Are here. you sure? Yeah. All right. Uh, <laughs> so that's it for this week, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, all the YouTube stuff, and we will see you next week. Take care. Bye, everybody.